Hey my love beauty, so I'm back with another video and today's video is going to be a quick May favorites and I love this month because it's spring and fun and it's my birthday so yeah. If you guys are wondering what kind of lipstick I'm wearing, I'm wearing Milani's um, Matte Orchid and it's so beautiful, perfect for spring and summer and I just decided to wear it and don't mind my ponytail, just did whatever to my hair and smoky eyes and yeah really hope you guys enjoy my may favorites and let's go ahead and get started with this video so the very first thing i want to talk about is this contour and blush 2 six color palette and it's from bh cosmetics i'm sorry if it's dirty but i really love this contour and palette and it's amazing i've been using this ever since i bought it at la at imats and it's amazing really good colors in here it's kind of dirty i'm sorry but i usually go for this color a lot and this like banana you could call it light pale color i'm not too sure what kind of color is that but i'm really mixing these two colors out and this is like a blush that i usually use on a daily basis but it's a perfect palette i'm gonna go ahead and review this palette for you guys but it's been my ultimate favorite and i wanted to mention this in my favorites because yeah, I've been digging this palette a lot, you guys. I wanted to mention is my Tresemme Thermal Creations Heat Protection um, Spray. And I absolutely love this spray. Um, I always use this on a daily basis when I'm doing my hair, when I'm straightening my hair before or after. I just love it. I have so many bottles of these and I recommend getting this. It's probably like inexpensive drugstore hair product so i really recommend this and i think it's like five bucks or so so yeah definitely had to show this in my favorite the next thing i want to mention is my avino active naturals positively radiant skin brightener daily scrub and it has rich soy extract and gentle microbeads and it's an exfoliator and even tone and texture and it's this little bottle right here i absolutely love this i have a new one this is empty already but I absolutely love this. Makes my face real soft and gentle. It's not harsh on my face at all. Easy to like work with. I love this cleanser in the morning and nighttime. So yeah, I use this a lot and it's very inexpensive and drugstore also. So I really recommend this to you guys. What I mentioned is my Olay Active Hydrating Cream. And it's this little jar right here. I've probably hauled this already. I really like this moisturizer. I use this in the morning and at night. It's just amazing. And even when I'm doing my makeup before, I usually put this on. And it works well. It's not very, it's not sticky at all. It's really easy to work with as a moisturizer. So I really recommend this. This was really inexpensive also. And it's a drugstore also. So yeah, definitely had to pick this up. And I wanted to mention my Pyron Spirit Brush Cleanser. When you're doing your makeup and you want to use that brush, you could just clean it off with a little Kleenex or whatnot. This works well. So yeah, definitely had to like put this in my favorites because it's really amazing. What I wanted to mention is my 3D Crest White Strips and they look like this. You guys probably seen this already. Um, I haven't hauled these or anything like that but I've been trying to get my teeth white so definitely wanted to use this and see how it is and it works well. I've used it for a week already. I feel like my teeth are not that white but it does make a difference in your teeth so I had to put this in my favorites. Next thing I wanted to mention is this Collagen Essence facial tissue mask and it has pomegranate and natural herbs and i already hauled these before i had to pick another one up and i got this at the 99 cent store believe it or not um it works well when you're um vacation you're in the plane you could just put this on your face i know it's kind of weird putting it on your face when you're in the plane but it kind of relaxes you um, i've never used it on the plane but I've used it when I traveled or anywhere else in at my house or anything. I use this. It moisturizes your face a lot and you just feel refreshed after. So I definitely recommend this to you guys. And it smells amazing too. So yeah. The thing I wanted to mention is my facial clay mask in avocado and oatmeal. You guys know this is like my favorite, favorite mask. I'm almost done with this 
my god i just love love this mask it makes my face really smooth and hydrating and refreshing you know when your face needs a little push and you just need like a mask on your face and just to make you feel relaxed and all that good stuff these are really great masks to have in handy um i really wish they had these as a travel size because it would be awesome but they don't but i just love this you guys know me ever since day one i've been using this a lot what i mentioned is my avion facial spray natural mineral water and it moisturizes refreshes and tones is this little bottle right here i know they have a travel size at ulta i don't have that but this bottle is amazing i'm almost done with it. it's like halfway and I use this and my Mario Badesco spray and I alternate between those two but this one has been my favorite um, before I do my makeup or all that I alternate with this one and my Olay moisturizer so I definitely had to put this in my favorites because it's amazing mention is my Maybelline clean express makeup remover and it's waterproof eye makeup remover and it says ultra gentle express removes even waterproof mascara and it's a little pink bottle right here I'm almost done with this and I've hauled this before like woo, a long time ago and this is my second bottle already this is really great I use waterproof mascara on a daily basis <laughs> and when I travel or whatnot I have this in handy with me and it's really amazing it does really take off your makeup you don't have to scrub it like to take it off you just need to get like a makeup remover wipe or whatnot you want to take it off and you just let it sit there and it does miracles you guys I love this you guys probably seen videos about this but it's amazing and I just love it I mentioned is my Tarte highlighter and I've hauled this before in my Beautycon um, haul and this is how it looks like and it's champagne color and that's how it looks and it's a very amazing highlighter before I wasn't all into highlighters but now it's like yes give me a highlighter it gives you life a lot it makes you feel amazing and flawless and all that good stuff so I definitely recommend this highlighter I love this. The thing I wanted to mention is these eyelashes from Coco Lashes and these are amazing. These are beautiful, beautiful lashes. I've been using this a lot. Too bad I only have like three pairs of these and they're the Ariel lashes. I've just been loving these. These make my eyes really nice and make that pop, you know, when you have that little smoky eye or whatnot. It makes your face really nice and the whole structure of your face the whole structure of your eye it makes it really nice and that's why I love these lashes a lot not just these but the other ones also but I've just been on these um, a lot so really recommend this I to mention our brushes and these are these brushes have been my really holy girl brushes I've been using them a lot lately these brushes are like life so I have to name some brushes that I've been loving a lot and the first one is this elf brush I know you guys are thinking like what the hell like these shed a lot like crazy but ever since I got this in I think it was a gift or whatnot I've had this and this is perfect for like contouring or whatnot and it's really really good to get into your hollows of your cheeks and it's really workable and it blends well um, I know it sheds but I don't know why I've been loving this brush a lot not just in my May favorites but in the past I've been using this a lot so I really recommend this brush you guys are not into like the shedding or whatnot don't get it but I love this brush the next brush I want to mention is my Morphe M173 and it's a very dense brush and I use this a lot for my concealing and any blemishes or whatnot. I use this a lot. The next brush I want to mention is my Morphe M436 and it's a fiber brush. I love this brush because I get to blend my contouring or blush or whatnot and also for foundation or any light BB cream. I love using this brush a lot. It's like my holy grail brush and yeah, I love this. The next brush I wanted to mention is my Morphe S27. And this is like a straight brush and this is really perfect for your crease. I've used this a lot for my crease so just to get in that perfect crease 
and make it really nice and pop i love this brush a lot and yeah i'll be mentioning all the products down below so you guys could get it and this last brush is my morphe g4 oh my fucking gosh this is like my holy girl brush i fucking love this brush you guys the g4 brush oh my god and look at the packaging is amazing i've been using this a lot for my blush to blend out everything it's amazing you guys you guys should go get it yes it's fucking amazing love it concealer i've been using my nyx hd concealer i've said this a lot already i love this concealer a lot like i have so many of these i probably have like six of them that i bought easy to blend easy to work with i was skeptical at first to even get this at imats i was like now nah. but then i bought it so i was like fuck yeah i have like so many of these now i don't even use my high-end concealers at all so definitely want to mention this in my favorites next products i wanted to mention are lip gloss and lipsticks and i'm a lipstick junkie like i don't care the first one i'm going to mention is matte blissful um, from milani and this is how it looks and it's a very light pink color and it looks like the color is not from mac so i just love that color perfect for summer and spring next lipstick i want to talk about is plum rose from milani and these smell awesome you guys and that's how it looks it's like a rosy pink color perfect i've been using this a lot when i go out and i don't want to make it too dramatic i just love that lipstick and for a dramatic lipstick i've been using my ultimate lip cream and brilliant and you guys know i love orange lipsticks or whatever the case is i love this when i'm gonna go out somewhere cool or <laughs> have a drink or whatnot and just want to make my makeup look flawless and really out there so yeah i've been loving this a lot and you guys probably seen it in my one of my videos it's a very bright orange love that then the next product i wanted to mention is my lorac lip lustrum cream in express and i don't usually go for lip glosses just because they're sticky and for me they're not easy to work with but this lip gloss is amazing it's not sticky at all easy to work with and that's how it looks right there it's a very light pink color, mauve color, so love that for summer or spring. Next product I wanted to mention is a blush, and it's from Sigma. It's the Serene Powder Blush, and it looks like this right here. And it's a very light mauve pink color. It goes with anything. I usually put this on when I'm not doing anything, nothing much. Or even when I go out some more, I use this a lot. If you guys don't own any Sigma blushes, you guys should go get it. I was kind of skeptical at first to buy a Sigma um, blush, but I fucking bought it and it's fucking amazing. The next two products I wanted to mention are foundations and I'm going to talk about a drugstore and a high-end. So the foundation I've been loving a lot is a Dewy Smooth um, from Maybelline. It's the Fit Me line. And it looks like this. And yeah, it's the dewy one. It oxidizes and it's normal to dry skin. And I have this in Natural Buff 230. And it's fucking amazing. I love it. I go more for the dewy foundations more than the matte ones. If I want a matte foundation, I usually put that on when I go out or a night out or whatnot. I usually do that. But for dewy, I love it for the spring and summer because I want my foundation to stay in place. Um, sometimes my skin gets oily but I'm more on the dry side. And the next foundation I want to mention is my Estee Lauder Double Wear Stay In Place Makeup. Uh, somebody mentioned this in my Instagram that I definitely had to get this. Um, I think she posted a picture. I'm not too sure who it was. I forgot. But I told her how it was and she said it's amazing, like the best foundation ever for a matte foundation to stay in place. Um, the lady that actually matched me up with this color told me that it's amazing and I had to get it. I really love this foundation because it stays in place. Like, like literally when I need to take off my makeup, it's really hard to take it off because it stays in place on your face. And it really oxidizes it into your pores, into your face, like you name it. Like it's fucking amazing. Um, I didn't take this for my trip. Um, 
and it's a drugstore um, foundation. I'll probably be doing a review and demo on this foundation. It's like my holy grail foundations for a high-end product. Um, I used my Tarte foundation, that's okay, but this one right here, this one sold me for sure. Like, it's amazing. That's the things I wanted to mention is my two favorite mascaras, my Tarte and Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. These two right here. And it's the gold packaging and the pink packaging. You guys probably seen it. I used this um, Better Than Sex Mascara on my top lashes just because it gives my lashes a little oof to it and it's fucking amazing it gives my lashes live for sure and the Tarte um, mascara I use it for my bottom lashes and it works well with me so I definitely recommend these two mascaras I think I got the travel sizes just to make sure that I really liked it but I'm for sure getting the bigger size for this one so that was it you guys I hope you guys enjoy my May favorites and I'll see you guys in my next video yeah yeah bye guys